Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series, which we're playing as the Heide Confederation. This campaign is going to be a giant pain in the butt because, well, we start all over here. All the way in Gramshar. Now we're at war with uh, Broken Coast, but luckily for us, we're on a historical. And they decided to go try to kill off everybody, which uh, has not turned out very good for them. Um, basically, we're going to go Ancient Tactics. I get the time recording it's pretty normal for me. Um, yeah, we're uh, we're definitely trying right now. Um, High Confederation is just super tiny. We have a core population of less than ten thousand. So what we're doing here is called struggling. And right now these divisions are all surrounded, which is good. But uh, hopefully in this war against Broken Coast, we are trying our best to survive. We want to make sure that we can get a little piece of territory, so this way we can core it eventually, and then uh, oh, nice. um, we can slowly just build our resources up in the north. That's going to take me a long time off screen to make sure we get everything done right and proper, but it's kind of a pain in the butt, not going to lie. So they're, war they're literally war with all of them, so which is really nice. Um, I might balancing balance things out a little bit as we keep, uh, go on in this campaign, just because kind of difficult uh, as I mean we have no manpower but that's a normal thing I know what blues but like most of the time I can work around that but like with so little manpower it's gonna be a giant pain in the butt but we're doing pretty well in army XP nice um, go and grab that too why not now we're using overall blues overall blues ex uh, tech expanded overall blues generic decisions expanded or plus or something like that and um, let's see. do we have anything here Ooh. hmm go about front of the operative already. Um, Overall Blues Radio, Overall Blues Bitches Formables, which is kind of weird. We can't form Cascadia with uh, as high a confederation, which kind of sucks, not going to lie. Actually, really, really, really sucks. But it is what it is, I guess, you know. Mm, technological Breakthrough. Gonna grab that. Close out of there. Increase the PP. Close out of this one. That would be bad to do, and I close out of Jurassic Measures as well. Advanced Sciences, don't really concern. Not really concerned about that right now. Yeah, just trying to beat up these divisions. Because they're divisions, we start off really small. They're not super great. We just start off struggling a whole bunch. 129 versus 73. So actually, we've done the most casualties. As these guys are closing on in. Um, oh, God. And we have a little bit of uh, money, too. So let's try to get a little more money first. We get about 2.67 political power every single day. Hey, we actually won. Look at that. I know throwing infantry in here is kind of a dumb idea. But it's what we got right now. And we are led by Chief... Zhuya, an orphan child, Chief Zhuya, never knew his true parents. Instead, Zhuya was raised by the village community he was born into and was thus brought up by those of the eagle and other raven alike. While traditionally a child inherits the moiety of their mother, Zhuya's mother moiety was unknown until the village elders decided Zhuya should live together without a moiety, drawing inspiration from both the eagle and the raven in equal measure. As a result, Zhuya stood throughout his young adulthood as a symbol of unity and strength for the Haida people, a natural choice for Chief. So now we're led by the people, and we'll be fine in the end. I just go take some serious amount of time to make sure we do well, overall decently. Nice little more manpower is good. Help them out over here. Um, also, we should we already have a Raven and the Eagle. More stability, monthly population, resource efficiency, game. The height of social life is broadly split by two moieties: the Raven and the Eagle. A family's moiety dictates which side of the village they live on, the history of their top, and where they fish. Despite the differences between the two groups, both will be united within families, providing a strong sense of unity between the two. We have whaling chiefs, more spotting speed, number of ships in first contact, and passive at Captain Come. Hunting for whales has long been part of the high economy for millennia, ever since their distant relatives first reached the Pacific Northwest. Whaling chiefs Ha'i hold economic aid and social power within the nation, and successful chiefs command great reverence for their successes on hunting expeditions. According to ancient traditions, these whaling chiefs can even connect to the whales in the spirit world, allow them to be located and hunted. Yeah, we're humanitarian scientists, and we're first peoples, too. Which is kind of cool. Now we're going to grab that for more daily uh, compliance gain. Okay, now we're stuck here. Which is not ideal. Um, I might actually send you four over here. Because we actually did naval invade successfully, which is actually kind of impressive. And then you guys can come from here to go wherever there's a port, pretty much. So get out of there. We'll take whatever we can in the end. And make sure it's balanced, though. 
Not bad. Point two two is not great, but whatever. We have one here just guarding our ports because I knew the broken ghosts would be strong, and they generally are pretty darn strong. But I don't want to get auto capitulated because that does happen sometimes. Um, but yeah, the Heidi Confederation. We're gonna spend a lot of time here making sure that we are going to do well, and uh, well, we'll take whatever we can from this war. Well, everyone, we're now we're War of the Whistlers. We're doing we're doing decent right now, actually. We got a lot of stuff cored here. Um, we have less casualties than them. We have more divisions than them. And we're just trying to set us up so that we are successful, and we need to attack probably well here. Let's take these two divisions out. Attack here if you can. Oh, hello. Oh, we've got the strong right flank. You're not going to do anything right there real quick. No. Stop it. Stop it. And we are getting close to finishing our land. Actually, two more military engineering would be good, especially in the very cold, cold north. I can't imagine living up here. Then again, I guess I've spent most of my time in the eastern part of the United States. Essentially, in eastern parts, but whatever. Um, we're beating the crap out of their enforcers, and now all that's left is their special forces, which is good. If delete their special forces divisions, that's what I like the most. As the organization is dropping, but uh, personally I prefer we could just destroy their strength. The organization is replenishable. Strength it is as well, but just not as much. Ah, uh, now we have an encirclement. Exactly what we wanted. Yeah, I know, it's beautiful. Government cyber schools are pretty good. We're running out of money. We need that trade node. We're running out of manpower. But what do you expect in the far north? And we almost have 100... Army XP, which is very good too. Uh, keep going over here too. I don't think we'd be able to launch a generic attack yet, but we do have a cup of decaf coffee here today because I would like to be able to get to sleep tonight. Maybe. We'll see if I can. Probably not. Uh, let's see. Uh, we're building on more roads, and we need, we definitely do need more roads and whatnot, but still. Good, 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 good. So after this war, we might go to war with Coover, perhaps? Now, Coover. Uh, they're guaranteeing and guaranteed by the Silex Nation, which isn't too bad. We actually might go to... Uh, I do want to go to war with New Victoria, but Coover took this tile here, and that's like the only land tile you can get from here, from the coast, into New Victoria, I think, yeah. So it looks like Coover's probably going to be their next best uh, person to beat up. Uh, we'll bring business because we need money. So we we'll come over here and grab this. Or break the soft attack, heart attack. Just four of them. Very nice. That's a movement training, very good. Um, uh, gonna keep doing that too because manpower is precious. But in the meantime, can we just do a general attack? Yeah, looking pretty good. Who do we not done? We've got all these guys done, which is nice. Silex Nation, Pass Keepers, we probably honestly won't go to war with them. Because I kinda like where they're at right now. Um, keep that in mind, keep that in mind. Um, Cryptology. Go and use it, we're here anyways, we might as well, right? Right. Yeah, manpower's gonna be an issue soon too. We're already on uh, four-year conscription. Service until dismissal. That's really going to start hurting us even more. But we have to do what we have to do. My son, you die, which is true. We get more political power too, which isn't decent. Um, down here, this doesn't really matter too much. Tim's tanks, trucks. Ah, let's go with trucks. Why not? Ah, we we're spreading out quite nicely too. Decent. Keep these guys in place. You guys are going to spread out all like crazy and whatnot. Just go to Whistler. But right, machine guns are awesome. So way too ahead of time. Go and grab that as well. Cool. Oh, and there goes Flalock. Goodbye, Flalock. And good riddance. Yeah, we gotta get to the cove. Get to the coast. Cut them off. Find them and beat them up. 45 arm XP is decent. Might as well help out there if you can. Go up there too if you too. That'd be nice. They need some help. Earl's Cove should be it after we bring business, monthly population, sure, why not? Better consumer goods also sounds pretty decent to me. How about Quesnel? That's a weird name, but Quesnel. And we're only missing scrap. And armor hardening is good too. Let's come over here. Um, we're doing decent over here, but I'm still going to need more manpower. Uh, stability is pretty easy to get. We're going to optimize trading for 50 more caps in total return. And, oh, they're up there too. God dang it. Uh, go ahead. We're out of that anyways, but whatever. Followers of the Apocalypse, you know what? I think that would make sense for our campaign. Besides, it helps us out too. So, Basically, for 20 political power, you get uh, a free city. It's pretty nice. It's a pretty good deal, in all honesty. Um, ah, Whistler, thank you. 
we got a lot of hills and mountains, so we're going to take this one. So, we're looking pretty good. Had a confederation so far is looking pretty good. Uh, we definitely take out Coover and the Silex Nation, so see you when we're ready to take them out as well. No manpower, no problems, right? Well, I guess we do have a little bit of manpower because we just finished the irrigation technology down here, but uh, yeah, manpower is kind of going to be an issue. Uh, country management, optimized training. We've got plenty of political power, though, even though we can't spend too much uh, of it currently, which sucks, but, you know, whatever. Uh, we're going to try our best to uh, do what here? So let's take advances towards Coover, which, you know, we're doing all right here because we do have our special forces. I did supplement our uh, special forces with a few infantry divisions in there, which is pretty nice. Got plenty of caps, of course. Uh, what is this? More 20% more attack is pretty good, too. Uh, but I want more manpower, and that's always a big thing for us. We are going down conventional warfare right now. Um, it's because we're not moving, which is ideal. And you guys, could you take them on by yourself, maybe? Or maybe have a little bit of help, and then destroy those guys right there. You guys go there and go there. As long as they're not moving, we'll encircle another division. Ooh, they have landed naval forces here. That is not ideal. Um, yeah, how about you stay there? Do the best you can. Strap them up right here at Charalia Garden and hopefully can circle a few more guys. Um, so that'll be good to get that one. Okay, maybe not. Get that one done. Get this side done as well. We need a doctor, perhaps. Equal settlement defenses? Sure. Come on, and we're there. You gotta rescue this guy. Ooh, I forgot we did have a. Or the cipher broken. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Destroy that division and circle it. Destroy it. You know, the good stuff. Um, help them out real quick. That would be good to get that one done. They're attacking up there, which is fine with us because we really do not give a crap. And as long as they're holding, that's what really matters here. Down here, oof, that's going to be pretty tight. Buying into mountains is, or hills, mountains, never a pretty sight. Never ever really a pretty sight. But we're, we're working on it. You know, we're working on it. You guys hold, you guys are doing the best you can, you guys are what? That's right, hinted Hill Souls downfall. Oh, they, well, they finally called him in, huh? That's weird, but all right. So I have you guys here, but I want the other half to be right here. I'll take them out. And the other half right here, too. Because I do not want these guys to be spreading out, because that would be very bad for us, and luckily we're okay so far, but still. As long as this group is done, we can actually send them over and help destroy a lot of things around here. That would be good, very nice. Help them out, help them out. Just concentrate your forces, blow them up, you know, the good stuff. Ah, good. Exactly what I wanted. It's on from the... Uh, I want more political power, but we need more war support. Um, what else do we have? Ah, uh, research speed's pretty good, too. Thank you, yes, we understood. Good, good, good. Triage is good for less uh, experienced soldiers' losses, because that comes in handy, my god. What else do we have around here? Yes, more organization is nice. Only one, but that's all right. Head over there, beat the crap out of them. Um, I like to come here. Oh, special forces are done because they're very special. You guys are over there. Uh, you know what? We'll return these two divisions over here, or at least put them there, and then I want you guys over here. Yeah. Here first. Come on. Ah, they have their navy in the water, which is why we can't quite do anything else here. Well, how big are their. Oh, they're actually war too. I didn't realize that. Okay, so that's the case. Go on in. Cancel that. Go on in. You'll be fine. Um, which means we'll have to fight the Northwest Brotherhood in the next episode, too, perhaps. 15,000, 34 divisions. Um, hmm. Tangle. Okay, they're not super strong, then. Interesting. 15,000, huh? Well, we got kind of lucky with that, then. Oh, wait. We want to see what, how big their navy was. Ooh, that's a thick navy. There's not much we can do about that. I don't mind them spreading out, then. Come down here, we gotta move fast. To at least take these tiles, these tiles up here too. Because if we're against a brother, it's gonna be kind of a pain in the tuckus. Can only imagine. So, yeah. Kill them off. Why not? No manpower still, but whatever. 2%, huh? It's like milk. It's 2%. Ah, the force of the defense. Landis is failure. Training would be nice, but we don't need to quite do that one yet. 
Uh, every cap for the army? Sure. We're still only building up roads, but, you know, that's still pretty nice to have. Get them off at least tier. That's not going to blow down here, but whatever. And some offices for 1% more recruited population, which is good. Spend some in defenses. Followed up with start camp production. Yes. How dare you let them through? Oh, go right there if you can, too. Awesome. Industrial fertilizer. Get more construction speed. You didn't have them life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. America, yes. You, yeah. Ah, we actually broke through. Look at that. That's nice. Just go ahead. No. It's totally fine. You don't need to go in if you just kill them all off. There you go. We're doing decent here too. Um, but we could be doing better. Port Frasner, huh? Ah. Very good, very good. Session. Quite ideal, yes. Nice. Uh, we've done actually 75%, which is pretty good overall. It's mostly cool, but that's a pain in the butt, but still. It's moving out, which is not ideal. And break over the river. You go enforce it. Just go and enforce it. That's going to be a problem. But we're doing quite well up there, too. found something which is good. I'm uh, sure you can ask for aid, why not? Come on. Oh, we did break over. Beautiful. Come on. Modern nursing is good. Oh, come on, we were so close. Start cam production, relics of war, not much to do about that. Help them out, that should be it for them, right? No? Oh god, no god, that's not really good. Not good at all, is it? Seriously, bro. How's that a core? Doesn't matter. Separate unit half because then these guys will oh, really matter in the end. I want to have you guys to attack here too. There you go. Destroy those divisions, these guys. Ooh, they almost encircled us here. That would have been really bad. Don't let them move. Oh, come on. Well, let's get the radio tower back. Losses are 67%. That's not good enough. Come on. You can do better. Seriously, you can do way better. Yeah, but what do we have over here? Uh, what do we have that? Reinforce? Yeah, reinforce faster. Why not? Sounds good to me. That's looking good. That's looking good. This is looking dangerous, but we're keeping it under control for right now. Explosive shells are nice. More entrenchment speed. Sure. Western birth has been decrypted. Who cares? Increased political power. Yes. More war support. Ah, good. Very nice. Serious stranger, life giver. Good. I'm gonna wrap them up like that. A little present. Yes, please. 107. Go grab that. Thank you. Assimilation. We could do that, but we're not going to. We're pretty much all done with this, which is pretty good. I would like to lower the conscription level, but time will tell whether we can actually do that or not. Which force is good. Power armor. It's gonna go recovery rate, recover faster. It's always good to do. You can always benefit from it, so. Go in, go. Just kill them all. Seriously, just kill them all. Because this is turning into a big old problem for us. 
You guys start attacking too. You guys are gonna kind of start coming through here, maybe, maybe not. Once this group is mopped up, we can send up this way. Or we can just go out this way too. Either one. Doesn't matter to me. You know what? You have up down there. Good. Nothing to do. I'll say it. Not so. You have plenty to do. Nice. Relics of war. Resources. Ah, oh, so I didn't say I want that. We could use more of that because reasons. Yeah. Organization for these guys. Very nice. Just trying to set us up so that we can do very, very well here um, in the second episode. Actually, Salix Nation needs to be taken out too. That's not good. Old Spokane State, huh? Traps looking pretty good. Nevada's looking pretty good too. Straight for the capital. Up out. Woke up again. Duh. More heart attack. More piercing. There we go. Start cutting them off. Rubble stroke. All right. Nice. Very nice. Trading is good. And we got him. Cool. Uh, we're going to go to again. So I don't mind taking this. I might abandon it. We'll see. Um, good, good. Okay. Yeah, so I want a lot of territory. And they'll probably fight us for it, too. I can't imagine their strength is too great in the Navy, on the naval side of things, good. Because we'll take the ships too. Beautiful. Now that's Alex Nation. Go in. Should be fine. Death stacks, yes. A couple capital ships, which doesn't bode well for the Navy for the future, but whatever. In the meantime, we're going to come up here and use this care package. And that one too. Destroys how much money we have, but we kind of need it. Bricks. Um, here, do that one. Field works, not bad. Daily command power gain. It's all right. Not super needed. We're pretty good on command power, but whatever. Sail. Two. Force and defense, but there's not really much they can really do at this point between fighting us and the Brotherhood. So, we're only 9%. The Brotherhood's going to get most of this, which is unfortunate, but whatever. Go and keep beating the Schnikes out of them. Nice. And we can close out of that one. Let's keep grinding that army XP. Yes, please. We got quite a few divisions. I'm enjoying this. New Victoria will be good next, but we'll see. Triple Warfare, we have no vehicles, unfortunately. Fortunately and unfortunately. 20 divisions just down there. Wow. That is a lot of dudes. Top bouncing's out. We lost 378. We're actually we're doing better in terms of casualties. We've just killed them. Well, they've done more casualties than us, though. We killed off 1200. Oh. And there goes the Legion. Wow, the NCR is pretty thick. As Twin Mothers got help from the NCR and just destroying Elenius. Sierra Nevada's looking pretty thick, too. My god. They can just absorb Vault City. Ah, Mr. Bishop in Plymouth, huh? 
Nice. Fine tools are good. Ah, we did spread down through here, which is awesome. 28%. Better recovery rate. Sure, why not? And so no map power, but what else is new? Come on, you got him. Nothing's good. More piercings, okay. My god, guys, can you... <sighs> the brother sucks so much. Loading still together. It's a left too. Hey, well, come on. You're running out of map by yourself. What the heck? Even a volunteer from the brother to steal. Must we do everything ourselves? Of course. It is the old world blues way. Or the Hoi Forward way, really. It's not bad overall, though. Go ahead. Uh, I really said 30%, 40% nice. Really trying to set ourselves up for the next episode. So we can core a lot of the stuff and take out the new Victoria, Northwest Brotherhood, and maybe even the old Spokane State. Gotta teach people a couple lessons here. But we're looking pretty good overall. They have to be completely out of manpower at this point. I, mean, I can't imagine. 19 Division, 7 manpower. Eh, 7 more than us, still. Upgrade our demo teams then. Are they able to resist us this much? Nice. Ah, finally. I'm kind of okay with this. Well, one big old enemy to take out, but that's right. Can we actually take one? Can we link up? Oh, that'd be... Okay, we got them all. All right. Oh, and that's not good, though. Um, so I'm going to end up there. Um, the next episode, we're going to begin with being at war with the brother Northwestern Brotherhood. Not ideal, but... Oh, well. If you enjoyed the video, though, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow as we're going to struggle, struggle, struggle with a nation that also struggles with its manpower. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.